Morning everyone. Today is the 10th of April. Um, it's about 10 o'clock in the morning. This is one of the most exciting days for any dairy farmer who lets the cows out. Today we are letting these cows go. Um, as you can see, they're all getting a little bit excited. Um, what we'll do, we'll let them out during the day and then we'll bring them in at night. We'll see how the weather is. If the weather stays nice, we'll let them out during the night as well. So, um, right, they're ready to go, I think. Are we ready to go, girls? Come on, Ed! There you go everyone, cows are out during the day. Uh, we'll be letting them out during the night, probably at the end of the week, Thursday, Friday, ready for the uh, Easter weekend. They've, um, they've settled down really well, they've all started to put their heads down and eat. A few of them had a run around, which was great to see. Um, the only problem I have with cows running about, and I think every farm will have this problem, is when you've got cows running, they'll run to the borders all the time. So you've got your first cows who run to the first bit of fence and what happens is that cow will stop, the cow behind will kind of stop but she might give the, um, the cows for a little bit of a nudge and the third cows and fourth cows behind those, what they'll do is they won't stop. So what they'll do is they'll nudge the, into them and then they'll push the fence over on extreme cases of course and um, obviously we are just off Ballon Road. So it wouldn't be as much of an issue if it was on a country lane, obviously they're not as busy so we could quickly run onto them and um, stop and get the cows. But on Ballon Road we'd have a serious problem, but luckily they went the complete op opposite way. They've, um, they've settled down really well, they've all started eating, a few of them have been nosy around the edges and stuff, I'm going to scratch on a couple of the poles, 
but on a whole, they have settled down really well. I'm really happy with them. Um, there's nothing better than seeing cows out during the summer. We personally, we will always let our cows out in the summer. Um, that's because we don't, we are, we, we're only about 100, 100 head. If you've got about 200, 300 head of cows going through gateways, that's when you start having your issues and they'll just ruin the field. But luckily on our medium to small size farm, we can let our cows out and we can enjoy them being out. So um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thanks again for watching and uh, we'll see you next time. See you guys.